And is that you, you end up coming into a braking area eight or ten kilometres an hour, perhaps, faster than you would have done at any other stage. And, of course, there's a oh! knock-on effect. And that was four into one, not working. Tom Chilton just losing control there. Oh, Tom. Clattered into Franz Engsler. And that is the end of qualifying for both of them. We will have yellow flags out. Surely you can't keep it green with Engsler buried in the gravel on the exit of the fastest corner in the championship. Red flags are out. But very unfortunate for uh, Franz Engsler. And very unfortunate for Tom Chilton too as well. There will undoubtedly be a penalty to pay for that, I, I would, would think. I thought they could have moved that car without... Uh, not without a tractor. Not, not, not when cars are coming in at the speeds oh. they are in qualifying. You know, I mean, you see how close he is to the edge of the track, Matt. You just can't risk having a tractor Unfortunately, there's there. no runoff area here. And you, you, you arrive at these corners with incredible commitment. And just the front didn't stick for Tom. It's like the Brands Hatch Grand Prix circuit. You can see Kurt Tremel there on the right-hand side, the team manager, the Austrian boss of uh, the mechanics here at Engstler team. They've got 400 guests. When he won in Oschersleben, they had 300 guests on hand. He's got 400 guests coming here because it's even closer to their Bavarian heartland. <laughs>